Do you find yourself throwing inconsistently in ball games? Hi, I'm Dr. Patrick Cohn. In today's video, I'm going to talk about how you know when you have the throwing yips in baseball or softball. So a question that I get quite often is, how do I know my throwing problems are not mechanical and they're really mental and I may have the yips? Players really don't know. They get confused and often they will approach a mental game problem with a physical fix. Well, I just need to go and work with my pitching coach or I just need to go and work with my coach on my throwing and then all will be good. All right. So back to the original question, how do you know when you have the yips? Well, if you can throw freely in the dugout or in the bullpen, if you can throw freely in practice, which means consistently with good accuracy, then um, you don't bring that to the game. In other words, things change in the game for you, then that's a good indication that you may have the yips. If you lose all sorts of consistency, all sorts of control, you feel like you can't throw all your pitches, for example, or you're struggling with throwing the ball back to the pitcher if you're a catcher, or any short throws, that's probably an indication that you have the yips. If you can do it well, if you have decent mechanics and you can do it well in the practice situation or in the bullpen or in the batting cage, for example, when you're pitching. So, the other thing that you have to consider is how does it feel when you're throwing? Does it feel like someone's stopping you in the middle of the throw? Does it feel like your arm is jerking? Do you have to go to an alternative throw like a lob or a half throw or a safe throw to get the ball back to the pitcher if you're a catcher, for example? All of that is an indication that you're struggling with your throwing and anxiety which basically is the yips. There's a fear component there, which makes it feel really uncomfortable for when you throw. But we have some great resources. If you go to baseball-yips.com, you can read all about the yips and some solutions for overcoming the yips and download a free report called Eight Mental Game Strategies for Dealing with the Yips Cycle. And I write all about what the yip cycle is on my website. Hey, if you want more information about the throwing yips, jump over to my website at baseball-yips.com and download a free report titled Eight Mental Strategies for Breaking the Yips Cycle. In addition, you can read several free articles about what the yips are and some solutions for breaking the yips. Thanks.